brand new piano. Um, I'm in the middle of doing a Shed the House conversion. And I want to do a video series going through it from... I have got most of the wiring done. Tonight, I'm starting on insulation. I will show you guys how I do that, how I go about everything. I am technically, by trade, a finished carpenter. So I do trim, interior, wallboard, all that good stuff. So hopefully you guys can learn something from me. Maybe not. But who knows? We can all learn something from somebody. So we'll see. But this is it. Our little small shed. It is 16 by 40. I will walk you through it, show you where everything is at. That would be my son's bedroom there. This is the start of the staircase going up. Right here will be the bathroom. Um, this will be the shower. Toilet. Bathtub area. Vanity. Washer. Dryer. And then you have your master bedroom. And the closet. But if you guys would like to see the progress on this shed. See how everything's going. Maybe get some ideas. Just turn back in. I'm also considering a few different ways to do my stairs. How they'll be to save room, efficiency, all that good stuff. So if you have a good idea, leave it in the comments. We'll see what I use. You know, maybe I'll use your idea. But this is it, guys. Y'all ready to put some insulation in? I'm not. I'll tell you that much. We'll see you soon. All right, guys. So I'm back real quick before I get started. Um, if you haven't never done this before, I highly suggest you wear long sleeves, even a face mask and gloves and glasses. Um, this stuff affects some people more than others. It really irritates the skin. Don't do what I'm doing. Wear your proper PPE, of course. And I just wanted to throw that in there because it, it really can irritate some people's skin a lot worse than others. So, I hope you guys enjoy. Maybe you learned something. See you soon. Guys, I'm really sorry about not being in frame right what here. What I'm gonna do right now is to show you how to go about getting insulation behind your wires or what's called flaying it and letting your insulation wrap around your wires. So you have that R value behind there and you got good insulation. So I'll show you that now with this piece. <clears throat> what you first wanna do You're gonna want to measure that. And make sure it's right.
stay exactly where your wire is. And you can either split the insulation Stuff it in behind there like so. Fold it back over it. And seal it up. Or what you can do is right there where that wire's at, on the back side of this insulation, you can take and cut about halfway through that. So that way that it can fold around the wire and seal off. Um, this piece, I'll show you guys how I do my outlets. And we'll go from there. First and foremost, you have to cut your inflation to fit. <clears throat> You don't want it too tight because you want it to be able to expand and if it's compressed, it does no good. So measure right in there, get your distance. Mine is eight or nine inches. I'm making a decision, I don't know where it's at. Insulated wall, and we won't have any worries. You don't have to use as many staples as I do. Um, I just like to be sure. So, just to make 
enough to hold it in there, guys. All right, guys, I'm going to end that video right here. Um, I just wanted to give a little intro and show you what I was doing so far on the project. And maybe I'll get better at this as I go. I don't know. I'm not a big person talking to myself, I guess you could say. <laughs> but I'll show you... There's the wall we've done so far since I've been out here. Just 30 minutes of work. So insulation doesn't take that long if you want to go the, the bat route. Um, you know, in some ways it's better for sheds to go the bat route for ventilation and stuff like that. So but anyway, I'm going to end this video here. I hope you guys leave some comments on the stair issue. Give me some ideas. I'd love the input. Um, and if you see anything else I can do better, let me know. I'm all about some, some positive criticism. However you want to say it. <clears throat> but, alright guys. Hope everyone has a great night. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.